Now, five, that's five defeats in a row for Norwich without scoring a goal. And now they're turning on each other. Canary supporters were seen taking out their anger. Chelsea alone, E. Billy Gilmore yesterday, chanting for him to go back to Chelsea. Quite unbelievable. Mm. The young Scot has played all but 13 minutes of their eight Premier League games since Dean Smith was appointed. Gilmer hasn't scored any goals and has one assist this season. One fan described Gilmer on social media as absolute pony and said, I never want to see Billy Gilmer don the NCFC shirt again. I mean, boys, I mean, they've just, they just lost the plot, haven't they? Some of the Norwich fans are doing that. So I mean, I've got to ask you, and we spoke about it. If you're not mm-hmm. a fan, please, we'd love to hear you. Give us a call. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm dying to know why you would talk. Are, are we missing something? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've, 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 Cass, I've got to be missing something. Well, it's very strange. I mean, look, should anybody be immune from criticism? Because we've no. all been there. We've all no, had yes. stick. But when you see a 20 year old player who's gone on loan from Chelsea to your football club, you know, you'd like to think. Could you really hold him responsible for why you've had such a dreadful season? I can't believe the audacity of the Norwich fans to chant that. And I hope it's a small section, maybe the I'm away sure fans. It is. I'm oh, sure it because is. Because I, mean, it I'm, I hope the home fans wouldn't sing that. Because he's a 20-year-old footballer. We've seen what he's done in, in a Scotland shirt. Seen what he's done for Chelsea. If I'm Chelsea now, I'm, I'm bringing him back now. Mm. Pack your stuff. Get yourself back. And we're going to find you a club in January that are going to play to your strengths. He's playing with championship players. They're not good enough, mm. the players he's playing well, you, with. He needs this. to play with players that want to play football with him, his sort of football. He's, he's, he's lost there. He's got to wait six months of his career, staying there till the end of the season. I'll drag him back. Well, you've just told us already there, well, the news was on, Gab. His stats were the best, effectively, out of any Norwich player. Best players. stats for a Norwich player, yeah. Mm. Sometimes fans want a scapegoat. Is, so they're going to pick on a loney, a 20-year-old loney. They'll be worse off without him. You know, they're losing three, oh. four, five nils. They'll be losing eight, nine nils without Gilmore because for me, he's a quality player. So I'm sure Dean Smith will probably speak about it when he next has an interview and he'll be disappointed that he got such stick. Che- Chelsea might be disappointed in how he's been managed as well at Norwich. Well, he didn't, he didn't play, did he? Oh, yeah, well, he's not played and look... He's in now under Dean Smith, we, we, we talk a lot about players who go out on loan and how good it is for them, don't we? Many yeah. a player we can say from Harry Kane and many others that have yeah. gone out on loan. Loftus-Cheek's done it a few times. But if you go out on a bad <laughs> loan deal and it ends up backfiring in well, your young time, lad... I said at the time I was not convinced that that particular mm. club would have been a good move for him mm. because I, I think he's the type of player that likes to play... Likes to play football and likes to play football with excellent. He likes excellent to go through teams, doesn't he? Of course he, he does. He, likes to... he passes through teams, yeah. And I'm not sure Norwich are. Ex- I mean, but as can't... well, look, look at um, Gallagher, you know, another oh. Chelsea loney. Yeah. But he's gone to a club where it suits his football. Gilmore has just been given, handpicked the wrong club. Get him back in January. Choose the right club for him, and there'll be clubs dying for him to come the to thing the side is, for them. The thing is, Gab as well, they're incompatible because Gallagher's away to Crystal Palace. Mm-hmm. And they're probably as attack-minded team as, as as a Palace side as I've seen in a long, long yeah. time. You know, whether Edward, Mateke, Zaha, they've got boys, Eze, yeah. that are very, very forward-thinking well, players. Schluck will get forward, are of you? Of course, yeah. of course. But like you said, Norwich lo- don't have yeah, that. Yeah, it'd be lovely for us to get a caller now, a Norwich fan, and just to explain why he had that abuse. Off the Apart from the obvious of not playing well, but there ain't many people who can hold up their hand and play well in a Norwich shirt these season, are there? No, but I think he's done all right, though. Mm. I think sometimes it's hard, isn't it, Cass? Like, look at Pukki, for instance. Last time he was in the Premier League, yeah. he was he was a menace. This season, he's not getting no service. I was at the Villa, no, it's not, I was yeah. at the Villa game. Him Honestly, Sargent, he had yeah. nothing, yeah. nothing. I felt sorry for him. Yeah, He was playing as a centre midfielder, and he was the one striker against Aston Villa. Yeah, Pukki, Pukki needs, to, needs service, and he's not getting it there. So, for me, like... The Norwich fans need to have a look at themselves. Yeah, Give us a call, sure. please, Norwich fans, because it's really baffled us all in the studio this morning. Zero, zero three seven one seven double two double three double four. That's zero three seven one seven double two double three double four. Because I'm, I'm dying to know. I mean, I'm genuinely dying to know. It's. Yeah. I bet he is. Yeah. I bet he wants to. <laughs> I bet Gilmore's probably thinking like, "Hang on a second, I'm doing my very best I can. I've got this, the the best stats from a Norwich player yesterday." What more do you want from me? I'm not the sort of player that's going to run through three or four players and score a goal. Yeah. That's not his game, is it? It's a very... Str- I've, I can't remember ever hearing of a 20-year-old getting a stick. That's, no. that's rare yeah. because most of us will give a lot yeah. of leeway to you know a homegrown player, or even a player that comes in on loan. You'll give them a bit of extra leeway. 
because they're 20, because he needs to be given it. But what does it do as well for a 20-year-old confidence? Well, I, I bit... think back to when I was 20, like... I mean, yeah, we you all... Would, you wouldn't would, would, yeah. would, yeah. would want to hear that, would you, from your own fans? It's going to affect you. So for me, like I says. If I was his agent, I'd be saying, Norwich, thanks, but he's coming back to Chelsea. Well, you've got to say, if, I mean, it looks too late, right, but if Norwich did have, were wanting to have any chance of survival, I think you've got to stick together. You've exactly. got to be united. Exactly. You've got to be a team. You don't start turning each other. No. You've got absolutely no chance. No. Well, no, you're right. And then having the fans not on your side, and I, like I said, against the 20-year-old is pretty rare. I can't remember a 20-year-old getting stick, no. uh, like, you know, Telling you where to go back to the club that have loaned you out. You'd yeah. like to think Norwich fans would be delighted to have had him come to the football club. It's just not worked out for for many reasons that we've touched on. Flip side of the coin, Palace. How are they doing for you, Cass? Gab? I, I'm I'm really pleasantly surprised. I, I think one thing you don't really know what you're going to get a lot of times with yeah. Crystal Palace, but they're a side that can cause you problems and, and look like they want to score goals. They get a lot of bodies around the 18 yard box and inside. And I think that's another thing that's benefited um, Gallagher yep. I think he certainly uh, uh-huh. has I think Hughes coming in thought he was outstanding last you see, night you, you see the difference between Palace and Norwich Palace Pace Zaha yeah, many of them Edward yeah. Eze Elise they've got so much pace mm-hmm. Pace kills when a team hasn't got pace around That's anywhere in the team, quick, Gabby. yeah, I'm just trying to sell You're myself here. Yeah. Pace, yeah. pace the pace merchants. <laughs> no, but but you look at Norwich and you don't see it in their team, do you? Apart from Max Aaron's at right back, you don't see any pace in their side. Mm. So that's the difference for me in both teams. I just think Palace, as I said, they have been as tack minded as, as I've seen in a long, long time. Another one, Jordan Ayew, probably doesn't score as many goals as he should. Mm. But I saw him up at Leeds United. He doesn't have to a shift. I think Vera's had a really, really good yeah. start so far. Sitting tenth in the league, I think the Palace fans have got to be pleased. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. I think you said it all there, Ali. Yeah. 